check us out on Patreon, guys, where we give you our exclusive access to all of our videos, 186 videos and counting. We just updated it. That's why I know how much, how many videos is on there. Bangers, too, though. Bangers. <laughs> you know, nothing too shabby. I mean, I don't know, like a Led Zeppelin marathon. We got Metallica on there, some yep. negative stuff. You know, I'm just saying. Just throwing that out there, man. So if you're interested, definitely check that out, guys. The link for that will be in the uh, description. What's up, guys? Your boys are back. I'm Ryan, my man, George. What's saying, guys? How you living out there, man? Shout out to the free thinkers, of course. Yeah, man. So we get back to Mastodon. Pushing okay. the Tides is the name of the song. Uh, album's coming out. Braun, shout out to Braun, the drummer from Mastodon. Big Braun, what up, Braun? Yeah, man. He reached out to us and uh, told us that there's a new song coming out. So we want to definitely get to it. I think the album is coming out in October, right? October 29th. 29th. The 29th is what we were just looking at. Yeah, October 29th. Hushed and Grim. The artwork is fire. Though. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. It looks like some um, nightmarish Alice in Wonderland <laughs> shit. I don't know. Um, we gotta look at that a, a little bit more. Or Brothers Grimm, whatever that show is or something. We'll, we'll see. We'll, we'll look into it, you know. But before we get into the video, guys, shout out to everybody on Instagram that's been voting on their songs Salute. that they want to uh, hear us react to. This is the best way that we figured is to kind of structure the request because we get requests in so many different ways guys go to instagram uh use the hashtag hashtag liv vote metal because we're doing metal songs right now uh at whatever band that you want requested you know that you the request that you're doing and then the name of the song so please do it that way that way we're able to track it it's very very important to do it that yes. way guys and one more thing guys in our bio on our instagram page you'll see a koji link click on that if you want to get more uh, votes. If you want to magnify that vote, you can contribute a dollar or whatever the case may be. Obviously, if you're a patron, that magnifies it as well. Please um, remember to click on that link if you want to get more votes, if you want your vote to count as more votes. So, so getting into uh, Mastodon Pushing Tides, man, this is a band that we just want to like because Braun's the homie. That's the bottom line. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we want to like the band. That's yeah. just what it is. He showed, he, he showed us a lot of love when he didn't have to, man. Didn't have to. Yeah. By this, uh, that, was, that was the first concert we've ever yep. been to, uh, metal concert that we yep. were invited out to, rather. And yep. um, and Braun was amazing. He was just, um, yes, he was. He was just uh, such a good host for us. Yes, man. he is. He is he amazing. Is. We're talking like the motherfucking yeah. Mastodon. Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but during that time, he was great for us. He was a great host for us. And um, so we want to like it. You know what I mean? Mastodon's yeah. been a band that's been iffy in terms of uh, me being able to wrap my head around some of their, their yeah. offerings, to be honest with you. But we know they're clearly talented. They yes, clearly right. push the envelope, right? And any anytime an artist I feel like takes risks and just does different things and they're constantly pushing the envelope, I'm always going to... I'm always going to be looking out for. So yeah, I'm man. excited about this, man, yeah, because man. they're always they're always innovative with this stuff. So let's see what they give to us this time, man. Let's check it out. Mastodon. Pushing the tides. because Ryan was just saying very proggy up in this spot. Yeah. And um, speaking of that, what this sounds like to me and um, is sort of a combination of YYZ. Slightly, slightly, guys. I'm not saying, I'm just saying to me. It, it, it's a slight... I hear it. It reminds me of that. Yep. It's slightly a YYZ and then God Smacks. I stand alone. I know it's a crazy combination. That's what you hear. Yeah, I get it. In the riffs, in the riffs. So in the drumming, more YYZ. And also even with the guitar work, but the drumming with YYZ and then something in the guitar work reminds me slightly of Godsmack, I'll Stand Alone. But you had mentioned Proggy in that. Yes. yes. In, this, in this part right here, that yeah. dun, 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 the, the part that, we're, that you're describing here. Um, but the groove um, is kind of like, you know, sped up punkish type of yep. sound, you know, um, which I dig. I, I like it. I don't th This part right here is a little disjointed in my opinion, but um, I really like how the uh, the first verse went as far as the groove. Okay. I like the speed in which they, they uh, were playing and I like the way that sounded so far. So, I mean, I, we're, we're gonna see, I mean, we're, we're still what, um, 50 seconds in, so there's a lot that still can could happen here, but um, that, I'm just noticing the contrast from 
that why why I don't know what to call it. I'm about to say the why why see. They don't know. So I'm trying to um, take in the contrast between this part and the or original groove of the of the first verse, um, and kind of see what they do with it. You know. Okay. Let's keep it going though. I was waiting on. I saw um, the the chorus, that, which sound like a chorus, and the melody, and Brown was kind of uh, doing background vocals lay layered there. That's what I thought um, coming into this, what we were gonna hear. And I really love the way Brown's voice sounded layered um, behind the scenes right there. And I thought that that more sound like a, 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 a groove, not groove, but more of a um, chorus. And I thought that that kind of flowed really well into that transitioned, why, why, I'm just gonna call it the YYZ uh, Godsmack <laughs> combination there. Um, so I'm hoping that they continue that throughout the song because I like that a lot. Prior to that, when they did that kind of breakdown right there, that dun dun dun, dun, dun I was like, ah, it's a little disjointed to me. Yeah. But um, I hope they kind of continue it. Right now in this pocket, when, when we got into the, you know, I'm, I'm assuming that's the chorus and um, how it flowed back into the, the original groove. Perfect, I'm loving that. We all trying to push the tide. <laughs> Not bad. So that's good. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't hear it. No, I was gonna say that um that dun -dun 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 it's kind of growing on me, but I think the reason why I like it is because it's coming out of the chorus. The the melodic layered chorus. Yes. The way that okay. sounds, the cadence of what I like that it, to me it flows a little bit better. Yeah. And we didn't hear that until um the first time the chorus came in. Because prior to that, it was just that um that that uh that breakdown dun, 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 dun. you know it was just that breakdown that's all we heard so i was like ah, i don't know if i i can really get into it but yeah 
now that you know coming out of the chorus into that i think it's i think it's perfect a thumbs up for me man i like i like the song overall over overall i like the song um i don't know uh where they're kind of going with the lyricism uh what i kind of interpret from the lyricism of pushing the tides and trying not to go trying not to go down and take it under pushing the tides, trying to keep my head above the water i'm guessing the way the way i take that is just i think that's what we all trying to do you know, I mean, I guess you could take that what's going on with COVID and, and, and in the world, you know, just trying to maintain, keep yourself positive, keep yourself safe, you know, keep yourself, um, you know, your head above the water, so to speak. And um, so I don't know if that's what they meant by that. But the way I take that is, uh, yeah, I'm trying to keep my head above water all the time, bro, with everything, you know, yeah. with with uh, with with how we run the channel, with how in my personal life, man, you know, I just feel like. There's always struggles and 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 things that you have to overcome in life that you gotta kind of over overcome, right? One thing that I like that they said from the first verse is um, he said it's not failure if you're trying, you know. And sometimes I think that me personally in my personal life, man, I I can confuse the two, you know, because mm-hmm. <laughs> I try and try and try and fail like a motherfucker. That's the way I feel. <laughs> When things don't turn out the way I want it to turn out. So with that being said, man, I'm excited to get into the album. Uh, they got 15 tracks on this album, man. Uh, looking at the titles of some of these, The Beast, that sounds like that could be something I can mess with, man. Beast. Yeah, man. So we'll, we'll see. But I'm, I'm interested to see what it sounds like, man. But going down into the lyrics here, he said, uh, uh, you try untying the weight and you, con- and you continue to breathe. I remove you, you for protection and where to go from here. I think maybe pushing the ties maybe involves... Um, getting toxic people out of your life that may be weighing you down. Weighing you down. You know what I mean? Pulling you down. So or an addiction. Pu- yeah. You know what I mean? Maybe an addiction as well that's weighing you down, right? Mm-hmm. Anything you, you can think of. Trying to uh, rid yourself of whatever toxic energy or toxic um, uh, uh, circumstances that you're in. Just trying to, to stay above water, trying to make it, trying to get to the next day, trying to you know uh, make a change in your life I, I think that that's kind of what I what I feel releasing yourself for whatever for whatever's weighing you down man so that way you can yeah you can advance so I'm gonna get at another spin man I'm gonna get another spin it, it has some moments in there that I really I really do enjoy there you um, go. namely the course and a few uh, few things going on with the groove that I do like yeah, so man. we'll see man we'll see you know what I mean shout out to Braun Shout out to Mastodon. Shout out to everybody uh, that's been requesting Mastodon because we've been getting a lot of requests from Mastodon. We always do. That's the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed that, please hit the like button. If you have subscribed, please subscribe. And also, guys, check out our Patreon channel. If you're interested, it will allow you to get exclusive access to our content. Also, don't forget to go to our Instagram and be a part. If you guys want to see certain songs and bands uh, you know, checked out, make sure you vote on Instagram. Yes, sir. That's available to you guys, and our Instagram information is there as well. I'm George. That's Ryan Lost in Vegas. We out. We out.